this is Coach D from Code 31 Media Sports. Today is my first day with Transit Tech. My new Brooklyn team is Code 31. Let's get it. Good luck to the team today. We have a special guest in the house tonight. Everybody, y'all, please welcome Coach D. And I remember what she said. 
And every day I would hustle at Baisley Park. That's where I'm from, South Side Jamaica, Queens. And I worked, and I worked. My junior year, I got MVP that season, and I scored 500 points. Her senior year, I became MVP. And then the next year, I scored my 1,000 points. I got my bachelor's degree. My mother told me she doesn't care about the basketball aspect because I wanted to transfer. When my coach sat me, I'm like, I need to go somewhere else. My mother said, I don't care if you ever touch a basketball. I want that degree. I got her too. I have a bachelor's degree and a master's degree from Mercy College. So what I want to tell you, I can always have a second dream. My only dream was to play professional basketball. I got injured on my job in, two, in 2005. So I couldn't do that anymore. So I, I drew, you know what I'm saying? When I was growing up, I used to draw. So I decided to do my, my clothing line. And then later on, I got into media. So when you see all this stuff online now, that's because somebody took a chance on me. But, but first, you got to believe in yourself. Everything, any dream that you guys have, you can achieve it. But it's not going to be easy. You understand? So I want y'all to work hard. I want y'all to bond as a team. The key to winning is that you got to believe in each other. Besides believing in yourself and believe in your coaches. Everything they're telling you is, is for a reason. Because they've been through it. I've been through it. So when I used to talk to my kids, I had boys just like y'all. And they would walk in the gym like, where we got a female coach? Well, I would close everything down. I played power forward in college and in high school. I averaged 17 points, 11 rebounds. What you see here. I was a little bit thinner than but you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but I had the heart of a champion. My brother made me a beast, you understand? So when I'm talking to you, I'm talking to you from experience. Anything I tell you is because I've been through it. So like I told y'all before, when you go out there today, from the jump ball, get them out of here. This is home team. This is your home court. You don't let nobody beat you on your home court. You know what I mean? So. Everything I do is in memory of my brother, Mark Ellison. And so I'm here in memory of him to give you whatever advice, whatever motivation you need to go out there and destroy this team today, I'm here. So I thank you guys for having me.